Okay. Hey, that's on the deal. Welcome to the Titans. Uh, why was this a good fit for you? And, and what do you what do you hope to, to do in Nashville as a Titan? Um, thank you very much, by the way. And um, it's great to be here. Um, honestly, uh, me and my agent sat down. We talked about it. And honestly, it's a big I don't see why it wouldn't be a great fit. You know, Coach Mike Brable played in the league. Um, he played <laughs> linebacker. He knows the position, and it was just a great, great time just to learn from him as a young guy growing up in the league. You know, me still being 23, I have a lot for him, and, you know, I feel like I can contribute, you know, me playing special teams, and, you know, just be great for me to get grow my defensive scheme as well. Harry? Well, talk about the mentality that it takes for a guy to play special teams and excel at it because, you know, everybody wants to be an offensive or defensive star, but it takes a certain mindset, I guess, to excel on special teams and make a living doing that. Um, you know, you just got to be aggressive. Um, and I know Coach, Coach Rabel knows that. Um, he played the position, like I said, so he knows the mentality that you need to play linebacker. And you have to be aggressive. You have to be able to come hit anybody at any point in time. And you can't be scared. You got to be vicious and you got to be uh, be able to strike at the point of attack. And, you know, like I said, my special team game is still growing. And I feel like this is a great organization that I can learn from. And I can't wait to get there. Buck? Yeah, well, uh, I, uh, and uh, welcome to Nashville, by the way. I know uh, I know you have some familiarity with Bud coming in, and and this yeah. is a defense that's going to have a, a few new parts. But what what do you got to know about the guys that are already here? Jeff Simmons, Kevin Byard, and and uh, and the rest of the roster. Um, I know I got some guys from Toledo that I play with. Logan Woodside, my quarterback. Shout out to Logan. <laughs> um, Two's our skipper. That's my dog. You know, he played on the other side of me. He, I wore nine, he wore 99, so you already know what that attack was. Um, and Brett Kern, I know he played point. Uh, he was a point at Toledo. I personally didn't get to you know, know him in Toledo, but you know, I just know a lot about him, and I know he's a great punter, and I know he's a great guy as well. So that's all I know about it. But I can't wait to get with my boy Bud. Shout out to Bud, you know, because, hey, man, like, honestly, I learned a lot from him, and I just I can't wait to get there him again. That's my dog, man. That's my dog. <laughs> Man, it's uh, it's cool to see you fired up that way. I uh, what what kind of things is, has Bud kind of shown you? Because I know it just for for all of the things that you were able to do on special teams, I know you take a lot of pride in in being versatile and, and being able to uh, to play on defense as well. What kind of things has Bud shown you in Pittsburgh? Man, a lot, man, a lot. When I came into the league, I came, you know, like I was overweight. You know, I was I was out of shape. I was overweight. And me and Bud, our locker was literally this is Bud and this is me. So, like, I just got to talk to him on a daily basis. And him also having a struggle in his rookie year and getting through it, you know, he had a device for me. And like, you know, he, he was just an OG to me. And, you know, him and Green Williams and um, those guys were OGs to me. It just taught me the game and how to succeed in the league and how to make a living, you know, and even off the field as well. Like, Bud is probably one of the smartest guys I know financially, you know what I'm saying? So like just learning things like that off the field and on the field from him, like it's amazing. And I can't just wait to go and just learn with him as well. <laughs> I can't wait to go to Cashville with my dog. <laughs> Kayla? Loving the energy, Ola. Um, you know, when it comes to Cashville, AKA Nashville, they call it Smashville here. I mean, there's many nicknames. Uh, what do you know about this city? And uh, it does seem like you're fired up to come here. It's kind of one of those cities that's growing at a fast pace and sports included. Mm -hmm, for sure. Um, I actually, I grew up uh, with uh, one, of my, one of my guys from Houston. Um, he went to Vanderbilt, um, went to Sam High School and everything. He signed to Vandy and so he obviously knows the city and me and him still being like this. He's actually here with me right now. Um, us being so close, like, he can't wait to show me the city, honestly. Like, he's just, bro, like, he's been hyping it up for so many years and just the excitement he brought to me. So I just can't wait to see it for myself. And the little visit that I had while I was there, you know, I had a little stroll downtown and it was lively. Like, I had a video and I was walking down just to find something to eat when I came down and I was hawking and there was a, tr like a tractor. <laughs> pulling uh, like a party little 
band thing. I was like, I was confused, like, but everybody was so excited. It was a tractor in the street of downtown. Like I've never seen that before. So it was just so fun to see that. And I just can't wait to get there. Who's your buddy? Can he make a quick appearance? Um, he's actually hooping right now. We're, we're working out. Okay. Ronald, Ronald Monroe, shout out to my dog, Ronald. <laughs> uh, he played a bandy and, um, oh yeah, but like, he can't wait to show me the seat and I can't wait to come.